thermal forming takes an extruded sheet, anneals it to a zero stress state where it's just below its glass transition point, and then we thermal form it around a tool that's typically about 160 degrees Fahrenheit. We do vacuum forming, pressure forming, and twin sheet forming, as well as plastic fabrication and some secondary operations. Wall thicknesses go anywhere here from about 80 thousandths thick to 780 thousandths thick, almost one inch thick. It is some of the best technology out there to make large parts, specifically when you have to have multi layers or low stress, because we are not an art, we are a science, it is repeatable. As a rule of thumb, the more you manipulate those resins, the more stress you're gonna build into a part. Thermoforming is, is fairly low pressure. Your vacuum form part doesn't have any pressure. It uses a uh, vacuum to evacuate the trapped air. We do use pressure to force the material down in some of our process, but we never get the material past its deflection temperature, and that's the key to keeping the stress out of the part is the material is heated in accordance with the sheet manufacturer's instructions for the deflection temperature. That's where the sag comes in. And what you'll see in different products, if you have a bigger product, you're going to see more of a sag. And so we control that to help the product be as good as it can be and not stress out the plastic when it makes its part. Maybe I should explain, all of this is vacuum forming. All of the material is heated and then vacuum evacuates the trapped air. In some operations like this, we use a female mold and we pressure form it. Pressure forming is the science of adding 120 pounds of compressed air to force this smooth material into this tool to pick up this pressure and this texture. Any texture that you could use on an injection mold, you could have on this pressure form part. This is the front of a medical ice machine. It was made out of metal and we converted to plastic because of weight and cost. And what you see is the detail formed by the tool. Look at all this detail on this part. This is all formed in. This is on the tool side of the part. Now, we started with this sheet here, this smooth material, and this is what it created because of a textured tool. Here at CNK Plastics, we're a manufacturer of all size parts, from small to large, vacuum forming, pressure forming, and twin sheet forming. We are ISO 9001 and 2015. Not all thermal forming machines are the same. Now, we've got three different locations. We've got three different kinds of thermal forming machines. Well, we tell people all the time, if we can't help you, if it's not for us, if it's not a vacuum or pressure form part, We'll let you know where it needs to go. We'll let you know that, hey, we're not the right fit. That's why I want you to talk to Stephen Giddens or I, and let's have a conversation about your process. Let's, let's talk about your product. Let's talk about your company, and let's talk about how we can help you move forward. Every project starts with good communication.